Zord Rider Transformers reviews and toy related chat Zord Rider Zord Rider Hello everyone, it's Zord Rider here and welcome to another episode of G2 in 2 Minutes and today we're going to review the Combaticon Swindle. Now this guy is exactly the same mould as the Generation 1 Combaticon. He shares the same rolling wheels in the same weapons that clip together on the top. Uh, and he will actually work with the Generation 1 figure um, if you want to mix and match. Um, but the only major difference with Swindle is of course these neon Generation 2 colours which are absolutely beautiful. He's got some bright vibrant ready orange colour uh, with a little bit of purple camo I don't know where he's, he's going to be uh, trying to hide with this kind of camouflage um, maybe in a 90s neon disco who knows but this guy is absolutely beautiful Swindle here in robot mode you'll see unfortunately I haven't got his stickers uh, I picked up this one when I was a lot younger and I've got no idea where they are I must have never applied them but as you can see Swindle has his beautiful big purple eyes that uh and his iconic Swindle face sculpt. He's carrying some big armaments, probably because he's an arms dealer. And speaking of arms, articulation, his arms can do a full 360. And you do get a bend at the knee, kind of, but that's due to transformation. And that's it for articulation-wise. I love this little guy. Getting the G2 Compaticons have become a little bit of an obsession for me. I managed to pick up Onslaught uh, later on in life. I'm still missing a G2 Vortex and I will get one one day. I've been Zort Rider. I hope you've enjoyed Little Swindle here and I'll catch you again soon.